Hello, it's Terry in Danu's Irish Herb Garden and I'm really, really excited to show you something. People who have been following the blog may remember in the springtime I made this lasagna bed as it's called because it's made by layering any organic material in layers like lasagna and um, you build up a bed from nothing. So in here we had some of these, see how shallow it is? Some of these willow cuttings have surfaced as I was digging out the potatoes. And um, I made this bed with hardwood cuttings, cardboard, grass cuttings, a bit of um, rotting kitchen waste and um, my own homemade compost which was all layered up. And out of this bed, which is maybe I don't know, 20 feet long by four or five foot wide, we have grown enough potatoes to last the two of us for a good part of the year. We don't eat potatoes at every meal, so what we do have harvested will see us through the winter into early spring. And this is just one box of, we've got about four times this amount. And that was after a very difficult summer because we had the terrible drought and then we had incredible amounts of rain. And I didn't think anything would do as well as it did, but we're just thrilled. And the best thing of all for me is this soil that I've built is incredibly healthy and it's a beautiful friable soil and it's teeming with worms oh there's another potato um every time i dug the spuds out there were worms there's one and um some of them were massive so every every square foot has loads of worms and they're probably going to make a liar out of me now They've probably gone down deep after being disturbed. There's a bit of cro cro uh, crockery. Anyway, believe me, it's full of worms. And um, that's a really good sign because whatever I put on top now, they're going to pull it down. And what I have put on top is all this seaweed. After the recent storm, there was a lot of seaweed washed up onto the high tide line and we went and gathered it and I've put it on here. I'm just beginning to put it on and I've chopped it up because it is quite a tough material to break down. So I've chopped it up into little bits so that it will rot and that sits there all winter. Um, the rain washes the minerals out of it into the soil and then it's an organic material that I will hoe in and, and then cover it up with compost for spring sowing. So it's going really, really well. And there's another lasagna bed that I made, also covered in the blog, if you want to look back over. And very healthy kale and cabbage in there. And I had lettuce and beetroot and um, some borage has self-seeded. So I just, I didn't mean to make a video so soon, but I was so thrilled with the state of the soil and the amount of potatoes that I've, and, and onions that we got that I just had to tell you. So this method is also applied to the herb garden and um, I'll be getting around to that. I'm just, this is where I've started and I'll be working my way around to replenish the soil around the herbs with n lovely fresh nutrients from the seaweed and um, to aerate the soil a bit as I'm turning it over. So I hope that inspires you to make your own lasagna bed. You can put anything into it, you know, you can put in flowers, you can make it a foot square, it doesn't matter. It's just a brilliant way of creating new growing space. So let food be your medicine and medicine be your food. Lovely organic spuds for us now. We're having lunch and we'll be having them for dinner as well. All the best from Danu's Irish Herb Garden. Bye.